You know, like um, when I first met her, it really was a God thing. The way everything happened, it was a God thing. My father had prayed the year before that before my next birthday, I would find a wife. And right around that birthday time, she came into my life. And so to see today is, is such a privilege. It's so, it's so humbling to finally be here today and see everything that God has brought us through. I know you know I'm not perfect, but God knows that I will try my best every day to do right by you, Femi. I cherish you with every breath in my body. You are happiness, and happiness is you. There is no start and no end, nothing with which I can measure the length and the breadth of what I truly feel for you. I look at you every day, and I wonder how deeply God must love me, enough to give me a man who is a reminder of his undying and unending love for me. person who was in your own flesh and blood so completely. The lingering looks and smiles, even 25 years in, it's so awe-inspiring. I thank God for you coming into my life. You know, the Bible says that no greater love can a friend show than to die for his friend. I would die for you a thousand times over again because you are my best friend. I love you sincerely from the bottom of my heart. I was called to love you. I was destined to love you. I will be your king. I will guide you to where God has promised us to be all the days of my life. I thank God for you. I thank God for you. If it doesn't matter, any other time in history, any other era, it would have always been you. It was meant to be you. I thank God for you. Baby boo, you dress too bad. Head to toe, you dress too mad. I want me a tough one side. It's a line, a designer. Original tomato. I'm a little baby, no need to. I'm a little bit of a reason why now I say. It's a line, a designer. Original tomato. I'm a little baby, no need to. We stand today here and now, fulfilling our destiny. All my life, I dreamed of loving a man after God's own heart. A good, loving, kind, intelligent, and gentle man. You, Olufemi, exceeded my dreams. <laughs> Although you've given me the gift of your heart, I know now and forever that your heart too belongs to God. The God who joins us today. The God who blesses this union. The God who will forever watch over our marriage. And so before the eyes of our most generous and loving God, I hereby vow eternal love to you, eternal devotion for you, eternal strength for you, eternal growth with you, eternal stability by your side, whether the sky brings sun or rain, eternal commitment to be the best wife and the best mother I could possibly be. <laughs> Tinoke, we thank you for marrying him one day soon. Anything you do, he'll support you 100%. 
and I could not be happier to give my sister to a more worthy man.